I never wanted to do a, a, an episodic sitcom. In fact, it's a secret that has finally come out. I, w I was asked to play the role of Fraser, and I turned it down, because I didn't want to do a sitcom. Then along came this pitch meeting for Third Rock from the Sun. Bonnie and Terry Turner, this husband and wife comedy writing team, who uh, created Third Rock, they had been on the writing staff of Saturday Night Live two of the three times I was a guest host in the 1980s. So they wrote comic review material that I performed, and they saw me as a comic. And they became very good friends. My agent called me one day and said, your friends from New York, Bonnie and Terry Turner, want to have breakfast with you. And I thought, great. <laughs> I'd love to see them. So I went off thinking this was a social engagement. And there were Bonnie and Terry and Carsey and Werner and Karen Mandebach, all these big shot Hollywood television producers at the Four Seasons in Beverly Hills. And I thought, oh my god, I've been ambushed. <laughs> this is a pitch. How am I, and you know, of course they got around to saying what they wanted to have breakfast about. And they said, Terry, why don't you tell him? He says, well, we're developing this series about these four aliens. <laughs> and I thought, how am I going to just say no as graciously as I can and get out of here? Within five minutes, he'd persuaded me to be in Third Rock in the Sun. Because just exactly what you said, it was an opportunity to surprise people and be far, far more than any one thing, even though it's only one character. These were aliens who were trying to figure out how to be humans, so they kept trying different approaches and trying, to, and trying to plumb the depths of different human mysteries. Well, that's what we're all doing, and it, doing it in this hilarious comedy context with this great premise that allowed me, a character actor, to just do everything week by week. 